Hi all, Karthik here from Design School by WP Algorithm. In this video, I want to talk about free widgets for Elementor. Well, these are not any ordinary free widgets, but these are the widgets that you'd find in the pro version of Elementor and they're from Crocblog. So if you go to this URL that you see on the screen, it's crocblog.com forward slash freemium forward slash free hyphen plugins. I'll leave this link in the description. Well, if you go to that, you can see that there are over 11 free widgets. These are not your ordinary widgets. I'll show you what they are. So on my test website, I have Elementor Pro installed and also I have the Jet widgets installed that I've downloaded from Crocblock. You can simply download it. It's a zip file and then you can upload it to your website. So one of the coolest widgets that I find in Jet widgets are the post widgets, as you can see here, and you can have all sorts of filters. So for those of you who are willing to build a free post grid, People have been asking this on the Elementor group recently. You can also have custom post types show up in your post grids, which is really cool. And here you can also select queries. So you can select your post from particular categories or by IDs. You can also set an offset. So basically these are the options that you'd find in the Elementor Pro's post widget. Let me show you that. So here's the first one is the post widget by the jet widgets plugin and this is the post widget by elementor itself you can see that almost all of them are identical and even here you can have carousel of posts so you can have a post slider you can also have custom fields show up and basically you have control for everything in the post widget of jet widgets so it's really cool and it's on par with elementor pros post widget so that's one of the first and finest replacements and moreover it's free. So for those of you who are using the free version of Elementor, you can get jet widgets at free of cost and you can get all the amazing features. It also comes with an image, in, image comparison widget. So just drag in and the comparisons can also be a slider of comparisons. So you can have one on one image or you can compare multiple images and you can have a slider between them. So you can add as many items as you want and each item will have a before and after. Let's pick one here. So just like that, you have your image slider and it's really cool. You can add as many as you want. So if I add another item, you can also pick another item here and there will be a slider and dots indicator that showing that this is a slider of image comparisons. It's really cool if you have a real estate website or maybe WooCommerce website. It's really cool to show off a few things. And then there's the carousel widget, advanced carousel. This is nothing but Elementor's slides widget. So if you just drag in the Elementor Pro's slides widget, these are all the options. So you can set background, color, image. You can also set all the all sorts of stuff. Now let me drag in the advanced carousel right under this and just like that. So even it comes with an image. If you don't want an image, you can simply remove the image and you can just have item and description. Or if you want, you can add an image. This is basically an image carousel or a media carousel. So you can also select the layout of the items. So just like that. You can also select different kinds of animations. You can also have all sorts of different customizations for this carousel. So in Elementor Pro, there are various slides and media carousel. So this advanced carousel is nothing but the media carousel found in Elementor Pro. Again, it's a very good replacement to Elementor Pro's widget. The next widget is the pricing table widget. You can see that in Elementor Pro, you have a pricing table widget. So the same widget also comes in the Jet Widgets plugin. Simply drag in, you can build your own pricing table, really neat. And this is also the widgets that you just find in Elementor Pro. Again, it's available for free in the Jet Widgets. The next widget, and actually I'm really interested in showing you this, is the Image Layout widget. This is nothing but the Gallery widget, or in other words, it's the Pro Gallery widget released in Elementor Pro 2.7. Let me drag in and show you what that does. And you can see that there are some overlays. Let me build my ga gallery and let me get back to you. 
the first one is the gallery built with the jet widgets image layout widget as you can see it has various options so you can choose between grid masonry justify and also a list you can also specify your justify height also these are the options present in the pro gallery widget and of course you don't have the multiple gallery filtering and all that stuff but hey this is a free widget so you can also have the same sorts of options in the masonry so you can build similar looking or cool looking galleries by using the images layout widget by the jet widgets plugin the reason why i chose to make this video is because few people don't know that they can get few quality free widgets or few quality pro widgets without paying i recently asked in a poll which are the best free widgets of course most of you were saying unlimited elements and others but these are also some of the coolest pro widget replacements since they have some of the amazing pro widgets available for free so check out jet widgets by croc block i'll leave a link to that in the description and if you're new to this channel make sure you subscribe hit that like button i'll talk to you in the next video peace